Just Northern Wolf, their own Colt. We're ready to go, all in line. And they're off and pulverizing quickly. Jumps to the lead. Houston on the outside in second. Dancel between them third. Northern Wolf on the outside is fourth. And Sunday Silence is right there and now fourth, moving up between horses. Passing the stands for the first time. Northern Wolf takes the lead by a hit. Houston with Cordero on the inside, saving ground in second. Pulverizing is dropped back to be third. Then on the outside, it's Sunday Silence fourth. Easy goer on the outside is fifth at this point. Three and a half lengths off the lead. Larry Snyder with Dansel at the rail is next. Then comes Rock Point and three lengths back to the trailer, Hawkster, who is 15 lengths off the leader, who is now Houston as they move on to the backstretch. The first quarter in 23 and two fifth seconds. It's fast, but not that fast. Down the back stretch. Houston with Cordero leading the pack by three lengths. Northern Wolf is second, and now the Kentucky Derby winner. On the outside, Sunday Silence takes second, and here comes Easy Goer with a quick move on the outside with Pat Day. Going down the back stretch. It's Houston in front by a head. Easy Goer, the favorite, up to challenge. Sunday Silence between horses in tight quarters there. Back into third. Dansel is fourth. Northern Wolf fifth. Rock Point on the outside. Sixth. Pulverizing has had it. He's back to seventh. And Hawkster hasn't started to run. Midway on the turn. Dansel on the outside to the front. On the outside. Here comes Sunday Silence to challenge. Now they're heads apart. Sunday Silence with Pat Valenzuela takes the lead at the quarter pole. Easy Goer back into second position. Dancel coming on third in the stretch. On the outside it's Sunday Silence. On the inside easy goer. And down the stretch they come. On the outside it's Sunday Silence. Easy goer with Pat Day. Back to challenge. Heads apart. Easy goer on the inside with a slight lead. On the outside Sunday Silence. The rest of them far back. Here's the finish of the Preakness. Sunday Silence and easy goer. Photo finish. Noses apart. I can't tell. But on the outside Sunday Silence with Pat Valenzuela He's waving his whip like he thinks he won it. The time, 153 and 4 fifth seconds. A dramatic photo finish. Either Sunday Silence on the outside, the winner of the Derby, who will try to make it two steps to the Triple Crown, or Easy Go are at the rail with Pat Day. What a finish! Dave, we have seen the race that everybody wanted to see here today. Two magnificent Colts battling out head to head, nose to nose, down the stretch. Who won it? If I had to make a guess, I would say Sunday Silence on the outside, but hold all your tickets because that is a pure guess. There's Pat Valenzuela. He did wave his whip. Charlie Whittingham isn't sure. No, no, you, I don't think he's sure. Wants uh, to be. But it's uh, it's going to be a little bit of a wait till the photo there. Shug McGahee. They're both going to go down the, towards the winning circle, winter circle just in case. 153 and 4. We did not get the track record or stakes record that we thought might be achieved here this afternoon. It wasn't for lack of running, Jim. Three quarters and 109 and 2. And these two Colts hooked up and ding dong through the stretch. I believe Sunday Silence probably got the nod. A really game performance. I mean, this was a stretch finish written in Hollywood. Uh, Pat, can you hear me? This is Jim McKay. Yeah, I can, Jim. You think you've got it? I think so. What does but it look like? Uh, as I said, on a guess, I said I thought you had it, but it, I'll tell you, it's a whisker one way or the other. Do you feel sure you have it or not? I'm almost positive. Pat tried to screw me the whole way around and he couldn't do it. 